what's going on guys my name is Garrett and today I'm going to be continuing the app design app UI UX design series this is going to be part three of the series um, in the last video we talked about how we were um, wireframing out this uh, this sign up form so that people could sign up and um, just like for kind of like a free trial thing um, and then maybe in like a settings section they would they could choose their like their it would be like a ten dollar a month kind of thing um, or maybe we could uh, put that in right here don't have an account let's say sign up for free trial Let's make it a little smaller and maybe a different color. Cool. That's decent. All right. Now Let's see. We are going to start. In the last video, I said we were going to do the categories with all subjects. Um, and we're going to start doing that. So, what I like to do is I just like to copy this. There it is. And obviously, up here, it wouldn't say welcome to, it would just say Unibooks. Or instead of unibooks, maybe it would say categories. Or subjects, I don't know. Subjects. Let's say that. Subjects. And then... I was thinking for this, it would just be... Like, just squares with different images. Um, for each subject. So you'd have something like... Let's see... Now I'm doing my different grays for hierarchy, so I know like when something's brighter and it's popping out more, that's the way I know it's more important. So if you come back over here, like these are really bright because I want you to read these, and then the sign up button is brighter because I want you to sign up, and then people automatically know like oh this is a sign up form. Um, so let's see. And you always want to use like a, you always want to keep a grid in mind. So that's what I'm kind of doing right now. Um, just doing this grid. Little, I could just copy all these actually. Just do this. I'll probably make these tighter, but I don't know. I'm gonna have a little text here. So these will be photos. These boxes will be photos or icons for the subjects, and then underneath it'll say like math. And then maybe uh, English. Um, history, all your favorite subjects from school guys um, science um, I don't know like business and we can make little icons for all these which would be cool um, let's see, what are other majors? Um, wow, I'm completely blanking. Let's see, political science maybe? No, it's just, I don't think we'll go into history. Or that, no, that's its own major, political science. 
or might have to make these this text smaller. But anyways, you get the idea. So let's. I don't want these to be really, really white. Let's see, maybe like. No, that's too. Something like. Something like that. Cool. So you kind of have this idea, and this is just honestly just to. It doesn't have to be perfect right now. It's just honestly to figure out. It's just about the process, about finding out what's gonna work and finding out, you know, is this really the best. Um, layout for what I'm trying to do and I think it'll work I think you know you can do it we can have a button down here that'll say subjects you know how your apps have this little ooh we need to do that actually this, your apps have this little bar let's see I believe I have a file that tells me how big the bar is so let's see here really quick mm. yeah so it's gonna be 49 pixels wide or tall excuse me that doesn't make sense it's not Where'd that thing go? Let's see, 480. Oh, this is for um. That's for a iPhone 4. This is an iPhone 5 resolution. So let's just stick with this for now. We can change it later. Um. But yeah, you wanna find those, those different, those different things. So. Let's see. Let's name this subjects. Cool. Awesome. We got something going on here. It's great. I like. I like. I would totally want to have this. Let's see. We can do. Oh my gosh, we're forgetting art. Art, we can have computer science, good old computer science, and then maybe communications. We're going to have to make these smaller. Let's see. I don't know how I like all this. But you get the idea. All right, cool. So now you would just you would be able to click an icon part down here. So let's figure out what we want down here. I think we said All right, so we did this. We have this categories area, so we're going to need like a subjects tab. So I believe iOS 7 does this kind of thing where it's just like I'll probably make these icons, but for now I'm just going to do a little, little text. Let's see, subjects. And then I know one of them we want is like a my book section. And then... I know we want like a I'm trying to think here, maybe like a what do we got? What do we got? Um hmm. 
I don't know. We can add stuff when we need it. Um, but we're also going to need like a settings thing, so I'm just going to do what every other app does and um, put those little bars up here. Let's see, I want to make them um, like two pixels wide. And this is a little too much. There we go. too close together. Something like that. And let's group these. Put them there. And then when you click that, everyone knows this slides over. And you have your little sections also. Um, cool. My books, objects. Yeah, alright. So when we get other things, we'll kind of figure out what we'll put down there um, but let's see um, categories mm. all right a my book section mm, okay I get it so we're gonna need when you click on one of these when you click on these, one of these, you're gonna need a list of books and then maybe like a search bar if you want to get more specific. So um, I think that'll be all for this episode uh, of um, of this series. And uh, next series or next episode, we'll be uh, working on the the wireframes for when you click on math and then it has the list of books. So uh, I'll see you guys next episode. Thanks for watching. Uh, leave a comment below, like the video please, and subscribe. Thanks guys, take it easy.